Hi team, this is Melissa from Melissa vs. Fibromyalgia here and today we are talking about five reasons why working from home can help you manage the fibromyalgia. Energy conservation and the ability to administer self-care are two very important elements to living well with fibromyalgia. Working from home can be a little isolating but it is a great opportunity for those of us with chronic pain or chronic fatigue. When I was contracting, it was fantastic to be flexible around my husband and baby, and it was really useful when I was pregnant with my first son and struggling with the pain and fatigue. I could go and have a nap and then start work again, and it really helped me work for a bit longer. Uh, when I was based in an office, when my first two were small, it was a nice change of pace to utilize the work from home option. It really does take a lot less fatigue to go out of the house. Uh, I did still have to transport my boys to care and back again so I didn't save too much in travel time but anything you can eliminate in time and energy is helpful and you're better off putting your time and energy into things that earn you money than wasted time like driving. But here are my top five reasons why it's good to work from home with fibromyalgia. You could administer your heat pack without looking like a granny. Heat is my favorite pain management mechanism and that kind of works with the deep heat as well. I love deep heat but it is a very strong smell so I feel quite a lot less self-conscious when I'm at home. You can use your breaks to lie down and pace the day as you need. Eating is also easier. I'm a grazer so rather than just sitting down and eating a big lunch I break it down into smaller meals. And if you're still at a place where you need to have a rest in the middle of the day, it's really great to be able to just pop in and have a nap. You can do yoga stretches without poking your butt out or getting on all fours in the office. And you can stretch your neck a lot without looking odd. You have more control over your working area. Now this is quite important, like temperature control, lighting, windows, etc. My home desk is set up perfectly for me and I have my Swiss ball if I get sick of my chair. You can also get heaps done without the constant interruptions and without the little stresses that the office provides. Research suggests it takes something like half an hour to settle back into a task with each interruption and I find that sometimes you can be capable of working but really easily distracted by noises or lights or any of those sorts of things. So these are my top five reasons working from home is awesome. Uh, another thing that now comes into the mix is once I have a third baby, I think that I will need that flexibility and efficiency in order to be able to continue working. So I will probably have to work from home, most likely as a freelancer, uh, just for that flexibility. But I will let you know how that goes. And it is really useful to have flexibility and the ability to enact self-care mechanisms during the day. I'd love to hear from you about what you do uh, to get you through work and if you are able to work from home and if you find that useful uh, and what you do if you're in the office, how you go about um, doing your stretches or anything like that. And we will talk again soon. Bye.